food baby i love food and i know that you love food too welcome to a bulgarian episode of food and drink we have banitsa which is this here looking forward to it filled with cheese and we have boza i'm not 100 sure whether this boza is from bulgaria because the lady in the shop couldn't uh, understand the german so well i asked her whether it's from bulgaria and she nodded with her head so let's see if you know better then let me know what country this is from and yeah i just discovered this today i didn't know about it and then i checked and they had this next to bulgarian iron and yeah i just took it and hoped it was from bulgaria and it was according to the lady at least but let's start with the banitsa very simple snack this exists also you know a variation of this in turkey albania and many countries and i can't wait any longer let's go mm -hmm. nice not many ingredients basically dough and cheese salted very lightly but the salt comes mainly from the cheese i don't even know what kind of cheese it is mm. <clears throat> now i got a bit more cheese nice and simple great if you go for hiking for example to take some of these they give you energy warm bite mm. i think you should definitely try these out the banisas in bulgaria when they come fresh out of the oven even nicer but this one is cold and i think it's been sitting there for quite a while today but nevertheless it's very tasty i love simple snacks like this i would give the bulgarian banitsa 75 points very cool snack but let's see what this tastes like this consists of water wheat and some other things Ooh. I have no idea how this could taste like. It's quite thick. First try of Boza, hopefully from Bulgaria. Mm -hmm. A very strong wheat flavor. A bit sweet as well. An acquired taste, that's for sure, but somehow interesting. There you go. Those two things fit also nicely together. Not sure whether I like it or I don't like it. I think I need to continue to drink a bit. <laughs> somehow good, somehow a bit weird, but definitely not bad hmm. i'll drink that from time to time not often but yeah kind of funny tasting and um, but not bad and i would give it 50 points since i don't know whether i like it or i don't like it so much so right there in the middle i will have to try some more of these i guess and let me know if you are from Bulgaria, what other things I should try. This one, very cool that I discovered it today. And the Banitsa is really nice and even better when it's fresh out of the oven, but still also as a cold snack, super, super cool. So there you go. Comment, like or dislike, subscribe, of course, to my channel. See ya.